Emily. Welcome back to my channel. And it's that time of month again to be filming my July deck of TBR video. Now for the month of June, I'm pretty sure I will complete my full TBR. As of right now, I only have one book left to read on that TBR, which I have not started yet. So hopefully I will be able to pick it up before the end of the month. Though I did pick up a lot of other books besides what else was on my TBR too. And we're about halfway through the month, so I still have plenty of time to finish this last book on my TBR. So I guess let's hop right on in and get into our first shuffle for the month of July. So our first shuffle. We got a middle grade. For middle grade, I selected the Tower of Nero, which is the fifth book in the Trials of Apollo series and the final book in this series. So I want to try to get this read so I can get the series completed and marked off my list of series to finish. Let's do our second shuffle. We got a contemporary. For a contemporary, I selected The Miracles of the Namia General Store. And this is a story, I believe, following three delinquents who end up holed up in an abandoned general store after their most recent robbery. And throughout the night, random letters keep dropping into the store that are from the past. So it sounds intriguing and I hope I enjoy it. So our third shuffle. I'll do a, a school setting. For school setting, I selected The Grief of Stones by Katherine Addison. This is the sequel to The Witness for the Dead. And I believe this one's gonna take place in a school based on the synopsis where investigations lead him to the Simshalarna School for Foundling Girls. So I'm gonna think this is gonna be taking place in a school so it fits the criteria for a school setting. Let's do our four shuffle. Set in current season. So right now it's currently summer, so something that feels summery. For set in current season, that was kind of hard to pinpoint because books don't really advertise what season they're in unless you're actually physically reading them or in the middle of the series and kind of know. So I ended up selecting 12 Kings and Sharakai. I probably butchered that. And this is a fantasy set in a desert esque era. So desert, summer, heat. I'm going to swing with this being set in the current season because when I think of desert, I think of hot, which is summer. So we will have this one fill that prop for me. This is our final shuffle. One more good just for kicks. A classic. For classic, I selected The Trial by Kafka. And this is where a, I believe a banker ends up getting imprisoned and must defend his innocence, but they won't tell him why he's been imprisoned or charged with a crime. So I'm sure it's gonna be an intriguing read since it is a classic and it's been around for quite some time. So hopefully I'm able to enjoy it because classics aren't typically the genres I tend to read. So now that the cards have picked my TBR, I guess it's time to get a book to unwrap. And um, so it looks like Percy's getting into them because some of them are starting to come undone. <laughs> but I think I'm gonna go with this one to unwrap this month. Let's go ahead and get this book unwrapped and see what it is. Let's see. Ooh. Ooh. Looks like I will be reading The Fever King by Victoria Lee. And actually, funny story, I actually started this book and put it down and never got around to picking it back up. So currently I am already about a hundred something pages in. So I guess I will be picking up from where I left off and hopefully we'll get it finished in the following month. 
Well, I do have quite a selection of books to complete in the month of July. Hopefully I'm able to complete my whole TBR and keep up with my reading progress because I've been having a pretty stellar reading month so far this year and hopefully I don't burn out. But I guess that's it for today's video. If you enjoyed, feel free to click the like and subscribe button down below and I look forward to seeing you in my next video.